hello everybody <clears throat> happy vlog day um you guys are gonna have to excuse my appearance today i am a little under the weather <clears throat> as you can tell and i know you're probably wondering weren't you just sick yes well i was and i got sick in alabama and where did i just come from alabama so it gotta be something in the um atmosphere out there maybe it's the change of the weather or being in the mountains i don't know but i have germs again so that's great <clears throat> so um this probably won't be a really long vlog today because um once i am done talking to you guys i am going to go back to bed as i am already in my bed okay i plan on literally sipping my tea and minding my business for the rest of the day okay all right so um that's that um so just a quick update on some things that have happened so i um was still trying to figure out the whole payment process for kdp uh select it was really confusing and i wasn't understanding so i finally decided to call them just to see if they could give me a full understanding in which they did and apparently all of those pages that were read on my book all of those it was a good about 800 plus pages that were read adds up to about $2.46. Can you believe it? I am so annoyed by that. I mean, I know I was saying like, <clears throat> better be more than $100, but I would take $100 over, you mean to tell me that my book was read, all, like the pages in my book, I only have maybe, I think 246 pages. So you mean to tell me that 246 pages were read to add up to 800 total pages from however many people who had the book and that accumulates to $2.46? Really? Out of this $26 billion KDP select fund, your girl get $2.46. Well, all right then. I'm pretty sure Michelle Obama is probably getting a good portion of that KDP Select uh fund because you know of course she's Michelle Obama and her book is like best selling book of 2019. So, but still, it was just really, it really kind of sucked to to find that information out that it was just like a few dollars, like. I wasn't expecting a few dollars. I was expecting it at the lowest, like I said, like $100 or something, maybe even $50, but $2. So um, that's really disappointing. So now um, I think my, uh, <clears throat> not subscription, but my enrollment in KDP Select um, ends in March. And I'm just going to let it run its course. And then I'm going to just, I'm probably not going to renew it. Um, what I'm more than likely going to do is start um seeing if I can get my ebook on other um, platforms, maybe like Apple or something like that, because right now it's only on Kindle. So I would definitely do that because with KDP Select, it can only be on KDP Select and can be on other platforms. So I will definitely um, rather have it on other platforms. That way I can get full royalties, you know, from book sales, as opposed to some random calculation of monies from pages read, like, you know, that's just, that's not okay. Like, I would rather, you know, just go ahead and get the monies that I need from that. And so, I really thought that that whole thing sucked because, you know, as a as a new author and, and doing this vlog and trying to help other people and everything, I definitely was encouraging people when I first found out about that to put their books <clears throat> in KDP Select. So, I'm like, oh, that's money. But it's not a lot of money. You know what I'm saying? It's not a lot of money. And I really wish I would have been able to get the answers because I was asking questions. You know, I had even posted it on Facebook because I know a few authors like to tell me like, hey, if you had your book in KDP Select, you know, um, let me know like what, what the process is as far as payments are concerned or whatever. But I guess nobody knew or maybe they just didn't want to share or didn't see my post. I don't know. But so now I'm telling other authors, okay, unless you know for a fact that your book is going to be a bestseller as soon as it's published, I would um, suggest maybe not putting it in um, KDB Select. I mean, I think having it in KDP Select does help with like people noticing it because they can download it for free. But um, I, because you have to pay extra 
if you have um well kindle unlimited should i say it's K kdp select for us authors it's kindle unlimited for readers um so if they have kindle unlimited which is something they have to pay for then they can download the book for free or whatever the case may be if the book is in kdp select um but um yeah unless you know your book is going to be like a bestseller right off the top and that you're going to be getting goo gobs of money uh, from the sales, then I, I wouldn't suggest um, putting the book in KDP Select. I would just maybe hold off on that a little bit. Um, but yeah, it, it is good for advertising. And who knows, maybe every now and then, not every month, but you know, every now and then I'll throw it back in there. But right now, my main focus is to sell the books that I have. That's my um, goal and plan and focus for this week. I have, I believe, about 20 books from the um, last batch that I ordered. Um, so I am definitely focusing on making sure that by next vlog, which is next Friday, that all of those books have been sold because I need those dollars, obviously, since KDP Select is only giving me $2.45. <laughs> so I am definitely going to um, focus on that. And if I do sell some books, hopefully I remember to, you know, take some pictures and record to um, add to the vlog and everything. So you guys can see, you know, what happened with all of that, because that's my, my goal is to sell as many copies of my book as I have, like <clears throat> having people download the book and, you know, purchase it on uh, Amazon is great, but that's a, uh, I get it only a percentage of the royalties, which is, I mean, it's a high percentage. If a hundred people buy my book on Amazon, I get 70% of the, um, money. So that's, you know, it's fine, but I don't get it automatically and I don't get it, um, the full amount. But if I sell you my book, then I definitely get the full amount, full amount of the cost of the book and I get it right away. So that's my focus is to sell the books that I have, like get rid of those um, ASAP and then order more books so I can get rid of those ASAP, right? So yes, those are my goals for this week. <clears throat> Excuse me guys, like I said, I'm battling this cold. Let me take a sip of tea because yeah, this is... <clears throat> Not fun. I hate being sick. It's whoever invented it don't like you okay if it was god god i love you you're awesome but this being sick stuff what's what's that about hmm? can you talk about it can we talk about it lord <laughs> but yeah so that's my goal so you guys make sure that you are praying with me that i can get rid of all of these books and continue towards my goal in certain things and there are some things that um I have been um, praying about uh, major things regarding my life, not just this book, um, that may be happening so soon. So hopefully that does happen because I am ready for a change, okay? I am, listen to me, people. <laughs> I am ready for a change. So um, yeah, <clears throat> we're just going to continue to Hope and pray that that thing does come to pass so that I can be okay. And I know y'all probably wondering what's on my shirt. This is another Kevin Stay Studio shirt. You can't see the whole thing, but it says I am all the things, which I am. And I showed you guys my um, notebook and planner that I have from them as well. So you've seen it, you know what it's about. The whole I am all the things you dig but yeah so that's it like i said this is probably going to be a short vlog today because i'm about to uh lay back down and drink my tea and um watch some tv and maybe take a nap and hopefully when i wake up i'll feel better so thank you guys again um make sure you continue to like share and subscribe don't keep this information to yourself tell somebody to tell somebody to tell somebody share it with people i'm pretty sure you know somebody who's an author or maybe wants to become an author, you know, this vlog could be very helpful to them. So again, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. If you haven't ordered my book, please do so. Um, you, like I said, you can order it directly from me. You can send me a direct message on uh, Facebook or Instagram and I ship for free. So if you don't know me personally and can't like meet up with me to get the book, you need me to ship it to you. I'm like Amazon Prime. I literally ship it for free and i know that be our main thing we do online shopping we be having a cart full of stuff and then they get to that shipping we be like mm. so you don't have to worry about that with me 
free shipping. I got shipping covered. Don't worry about it. Just pay the cost of your book. And everything else is on me. So that is all for today. I hope you guys have a great day and a great weekend as well. Um, hopefully I will be feeling better by the next time I talk to you guys and won't have any more germs. And so that's it. Love you guys. Bye.